There's some new math for Minnesota schools. The free meals program started this year is sprouting faster than expected. New data shows students received almost 50 million meals in the first three months of the school year. Our Corn Hoggard went to Fridley where Governor Tim Wolf served up breakfast and defended a sizable budget increase. Good morning, Good fresh morning. muffin. Governor Tim Walls handed out the free breakfast at Fridley Middle School Friday. Maybe it was the Fridley ball cap, but as a few hundred kids filtered through the line, only a few of them realized they had celebrity servers. You know who just served you muffins? No. No? What if I told you that was the governor of Minnesota? The, the, the governor? <laughs> yeah. The governor. That's pretty cool. Scientific research has shown kids who are hungry perform worse in school, both in academics and conduct. And it all starts with breakfast. Fridley Middle School teacher Jessica Riffley told me she's noticed a night and day difference in her students' behavior since Minnesota adopted universal free meals in the fall. This program has made a tremendous difference because not only are my students able to come to class and learn, but they're able to then access higher thinking. Here at Fridley Middle School, they even give kids a second chance at breakfast out in the hallways. All told, the Fridley District is serving up about 10% more breakfast this year than before universal free meals. Statewide, the numbers are even higher. 4.3 million more breakfasts served this fall, a 37% increase. 4.5 million more lunches, up 15%. Democrats said it would be popular, but even they underestimated how popular, and that's reflected in new education budget numbers. Over the next two years, they're asking for an extra $109 million for school meals, while cutting about $30 million from the rest of the general education budget. And we will budget for a 37% increase next year that we got out of this and, and make it work. It, this, is, this is money saved in the long run. Two other bills in this year's legislature could guarantee free milk for kids who bring their own meals and make sure they get at least 15 minutes of seated time to eat lunch. In Fridley, Corn Hoggard, Fox 9.